Hi, welcome to the Resources Roadhouse, I'm Wally Graham. I'm in Brisbane, I'm at the 2018 Brisbane Resources Roundup and I'm with Chris Van Wick who is CEO of Indiana Resources. Now, Chris, a WA based company at a uh, conference in Queensland talking up a gold project in the country of Mali. Uh, that, that's yeah, that's uh, quite a circuitous uh, route to get to where we want to go. But um, so in Mali, uh, can you tell us a bit about your projects there? Absolutely. We've got uh, four licenses in Western Mali in the Kenyaba window. And what a lot of people don't know is that Western Mali is as well endowed as the Yilgarn Kraton, but not as well picked over. And in short, that's the reason we're there. And so you're there, um, what projects have you got and what, you, um, what, what sort of activities have you got going on there at the moment? So we have four licenses, they're early stage exploration projects. We've done air core drilling at the moment which is sort of reconnaissance work and we've had some really interesting hits like 18 metres at 3 grams a tonne and we're really planning in the coming season with following that up, a couple, couple more rounds of air core to firm up the targets and then RC drilling to hopefully get us underway on the road to a resource. Okay, so you're just sort of saying then, okay, that we are um, very similar to the Yilgarn Creighton of WA. Um, is that what took you over to Mali, to, or were you sort of over there having a look and came across that? Well, I've got experience in West Africa, and our chairman Bronwyn Barnes has worked a long time in, in West Africa as well. So, we we speak French and we we know how to operate in West Africa. But the, the primary driver was the geology. Um, the Brimian rocks are, are reasonably well understood and have a lot of similarities with WA. So we could apply a lot of the same techniques that we use in Australia straight into West Africa. And we're, we're reasonably confident that those will work. Okay, and, and being where you are, have you sort of uh, realised, that? You know, are, are you noticing a bit of uh, interest in uh, what you're doing over there? Absolutely. The, the recent deal between Barrick and Rangold has really put a, a big focus on West Africa and as a result we've seen a lot of interest in recent weeks um, with investors looking for projects and, and trying to find the next big thing. Okay, so well obviously you're trying to find the next best big thing. Um, good luck with that and uh, we'll uh, follow uh, your progress and hopefully bring a lot more news about Indiana Resources to the Resources Roadhouse. Thanks Chris. Thank you very much, Wally. And our tick is IDA. IDA. You heard that first. Thank you, Wally.